Do you participate in April Fool's type activity? I love Oh, April. you do? Wow, I love it. Oh, okay. By the way, and I just want to say, wow, buddy, getting woken up by Rihanna, you better get in here. Get <laughs> wow. I wish, I wish wow. it went like that. Dreams come true. I know, I should have just locked the door and kept her there. <laughs> Good man, by the way. Uh, but yes, like Rihanna, obviously I, I love April Fools, but the thing about it is, is I love doing, but my April Fools runs the entire year. I see, yes, so I'm for similar. Example, yeah, yeah, because it's like April Fools, everyone's expecting it. So this past, around Christmas time, we were getting ready to uh, make a big announcement for a movie, and I called my agent. I was, uh, I was overseas, and I called my agent, Brad Slater. I woke him up in the middle of the night, and I was like, hey, man, I got to talk to you. He's like, what's going on? What's wrong? I said, I don't know how it happened, but my cousin, who, who was on tour with us, I said, just got busted with prostitutes, and my name is attached to it now, and it's all getting ready to hit the press. He started freaking out. I was like, Brad, are you OK? He was getting emotional. Oh, my God, what are we going to do? OK, hold on. And he goes, I'm going to be calm in the pocket. I'm thinking about this. Hold on. And I was like, I don't know what to do. I think there's multiple prostitutes with this thing. There's a whole <laughs> ring over here. It's unbelievable. Had him going and going and going. And finally, I was like, oh, Brad, Brad, Brad. He's like, what? I was like, December fool. <laughs> It's ridiculous. And it's ridiculous. And that's the thing. I, I'm like, this is I, you got to say it like that. And there was a long pause. Have you ever heard the story about the boy who cried wolf? You have to be very careful. He might not take the call next time. Especially with prostitutes. <laughs> that's yeah, right. By the way. <laughs>